Okay, here we go again. Why do I do my? Why do I do this to myself? Why? Ugh. Can I? I was gonna say I'm pretty sure I couldn't move that. Can can I move those? Is is, is that a thing that can be done? Um. Ah. Oh, I think I've worked out how to do this now. There we go. Okay. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Oof. Shit. No. Run, you fool. Is that it? Hmm. I was... I was expecting worse. Frank, I'm glad it wasn't worse, but I was expecting worse. Oh, there's no torch in there. Great. Thank you very fucking much, game. Okay. Um... Well, that's not pleasant. <laughs> Don't know why I was still crouching. Ugh. The view's gone really weird. I don't know whether it's because I'm freaking out or what. Drunk. Is there nothing in here? Nothing at all. Apparently not. Let's go through here first. Did I come with Jesus Christ? It's dark. in the box. And rats. Just locked off. <laughs> of course you do. Jesus. 
choose to ignore. Whoa. Fuck. Move. Shit. I'm definitely in the wrong fucking room. Oh god, I'm gonna die. It's gonna kill me. It's gonna find me and it's going to kill me. <laughs> I think I can never really tell when it's gone because like the never the music never really completely stops. <sighs> I thought we saw a shadow there then. Okay, I think he's gone. So now I can't actually remember which... Why am I still crouching? I can't actually remember which way it was I supposed to be going. This is getting way too intense. Horrible feeling about all of this. Ooh. Ah! Where is she? Where did she go? No! Oh, tell! I'll never tell you! You're just making things worse. What? This is no place for a young girl all by herself. She could be hurt or worse. There's no telling what horrors await down there. That was... That was Daniel. As in, me. Is... Is he helping Alexander? Well, I mean, I know he's... Living there. Is, no. Is this a, is this a thing? Yes, it is. I mean, obviously... I would have thought you would have helped him. Like... Yeah. <laughs> that was honestly a guess. Well, whenever. You know, there's always something that's like, Oh no, you, you can't go with this one. Earth is that? I don't even want to know, honestly. Anything else in here? Under the bed? Nope. Doesn't seem to be. Oh, nice. Oh, God. There's rumbling in my flat. Well, it sounds like there is. Why am I doing this? I'm just gonna... You've gotta stay the fuck away from me. I don't even know if he's still outside. I don't even really know where I'm going. Oh, fuck's sake. 
every damn time. Great. Protecting mothers and children. Lovely. There we go. Seriously? Okay. Um. Oh! Oh, I still have this. Okay. <laughs> that works. So this entire hole was conveniently here. Like, they they managed to dig this entire tunnel. Oh, for fuck's sake. Nope. I still, yeah, right. <laughs> storage. Oh, we're going back to storage. This is horrifically dark. Screw all other passageways, go to storage. Um... Is, is, is there another sign? Yes. Is he safe? Well, it's for his own. I'm just gonna hide in here. I have arrived at the village of Altstadt. It's a haven in the midst of a vast forest and the last stop before my final destination, Castle Brennenburg. It's late in the evening and the outrider, who has been with the coach since Bremen, advised me to wait until morning before I venture further. I've arranged for a bed at Der Mühle, the village's only inn, and am now waiting for the sun to rise. I try to sleep, but as I close my eyes, I see the men who fell victim in London. My fear and shame forces me to witness the same scenes over and over. They are dead because of me. Oh. I feel, I'm honestly feeling a little bit sick. Soon be ready. Let there be enough time. No! No! Why? Get the fuck back in there. Well, I get the fucking here. Why would you do that to me? That's just not fair. That's 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 horrible. I locked I locked myself in the room with the thing. What the hell? You stay out there. Well, actually, no, piss off. But stay out there. Don't come in here. Oh, that was horrible! That was like... Proper... Horror movie shit mistake. <laughs> I 
Is there anything else in here? Are you still out there? Why am I whispering? Broken the door. Is that all that was in here? Oh, fuck. I don't know which way I'm supposed to be going. Hmm, okay. I could do with some food. My housemate isn't going to be back till nine, so... I don't know whether he's after me or not. Okay, no, this is... What was this way? I'm so confused. loop then, okay. I don't even know if this is the right way. I'm just going because I am not facing that thing again for a while. I bet you this will be a dead end. Wait a minute. Am I... Is this the pole that... Yes, it fucking is. Lovely. Thank you very much, game. Why would you do this to me? Kitchen. Oh, God. There we go. Keep accidentally hitting the crawl button. Check everything else first before I get that note. Lord, no, my main well need that if the monster finds me again. I should be taking. I shall fight him off with a wine bottle. I'll drink the wine first! Uh. 3rd of August, 1839. I feel like I have fled the world and all its worries. Brennenberg is a majestic creation perched upon a forest-clad hill with towers reaching well above even the highest pine trees. Following the winding road leading to the gates gives the impression of discovering something forgotten, 
as if journeying with Marco Polo to the hidden Xanadu. Alexander, the Baron, is a peculiar but gracious man. He seems well versed in worldly matters and is not at all as eccentric as I assumed. My room is exquisite and I'm confident that no hotel for miles could even hope to match it. As the sun sets on Brennenberg, its fairy tale varnish turns to an eerie gloom. Alexander's strange servants are never far away. They are a quiet lot, and their behavior could only be described as skulking. Alexander seems pleased by my presence. As he puts it, it seems like I got here just in time. Is Alexander even tempting to seduce you? This is what's going on. I bet you actually. I bet there is horrible smut thick about this. Like, me, my housemate, and one of my friends were watching uh, Catfish the other day. And we were like, I bet, I bet there's smut thick about the two hosts of Catfish. There is! Um. Okay. <laughs> There's a barrel filled with acid in the kitchen, because that's completely fucking normal. I mean, who doesn't have acid in their kitchen? I blew up my last bloody thing, didn't I? Budge. Great. <laughs> well, so obviously I'm going to have to shatter that, but... Come on. Uh... Damn it. I've obviously missed something somewhere. That fucking monstrosity chasing me around. I can't exactly find anything, can I? Right, there's nothing here. I'm assuming there's like a pot of some kind to put the acid in. Can't move any of them. Very poor condition. What am I doing? Okay. That one is probably the one I've got to melt. Ah! Okay. Hey, you! Stop! Don't come any closer! I just want to leave! You can't go outside! It's too dangerous! I'm telling Gabriel! I doubt that very much. Oh, God. I'm gonna assume this is the right way, then. Come on, Budge. Why am I not surprised? can never go too far without you turning up, can I? Bastard. Okay, it's locked. Oh, shit. Well, at least I know where he is.
Oh. God. Oh, is that because I'm going crazy? Ah. That's interesting. I have absolutely no fucking clue where I'm going. Hell do I go? That's that padlock, and there's where I was hiding, right, okay. So that's a circle. Go back towards storage, then, I suppose. Oh, for fuck's sake. I mean, at least I found it now, but Jesus. Stay open! I'm in no mood for this! I bet you will turn back up. I bet you. Fucking told you. Scream and run. Can I turn out the lights? No, apparently not. Ooh, tinderbox. Right. Oh, of course, I should have just bloody looked for the sign, shouldn't I? <sighs> Fuck off. This is not the time. Oh shit! Fuck, 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 fuck. Oh my god. Oh my god, fuck off out of this kitchen. 
There's not supposed to be too many chefs in one kitchen. That was a terrible joke, I don't care. <laughs> I want to check and see if he's gone, but I don't want to check and see if he's gone. I think he's gone. There he is. Little bitch. Oh, it would be the way he's fucking gone, hasn't it? Wouldn't it, I mean. Terrible grammar there. Pretty sure it was this way. Please be the right one. Yes! Yes! Goodbye! In your fucking face. <sighs> Jesus. Fuck you. Fuck you. Ugh. Obligatory sewer level. Lovely. As long as he's... So you used the drain sewers as a means of transport? Yes, they were built to divert water from an underground spring, and are quite spacious. It seemed only natural to incorporate it into the overall structure. But we won't be using it. Not today. The flow is seasonal, and when the spring runs dry, the damp tunnels produce a rather poisonous type of fungi. There is an antidote, of course, but we won't be bothering with it today. Come, this way instead. We're almost there. Alexander, is there any part of your house that's not a death trap? 